hello my wonderful people yeah welcome back to my channel thank you for clicking on this video so today i want to address the issue of the measurements on our tape rule how you can get a measurement that's way more than what we have on the tape rule so i made a video one of my previous videos and the, where i showed how to make a gypsy skirt or gypsy um, gypsy gown so i've been getting this question that how did i get the measurement because the measurements were way more than what we have on our measuring tape so i have come to show you that instead of answering the questions one by one i started to make this video okay so if you're new to this channel i say a very big welcome to you thank you for clicking on this video and please join this wonderful family by subscribing it is absolutely free just hit on the subscribe button to be part of this wonderful family and also turn on the notification bell turn all notifications okay so that whenever i upload a new video you'll be among those that will be notified thank you for doing that and to all my returning subscribers god bless you so much you are all wonderful so without taking so much time let's move to the lesson of the day so like i said in my previous video yes where i showed how to make a gypsy skirt or gypsy gown so the measurements i used there were well above what we have on the tape i used like 180 like that okay so and i'll be getting this question so it is actually simple what you will do is you take your measuring tape and you measure okay up to where you have it up to the end of the figure on the tape so in this very tape is 60 inches okay the tape rule stopped at 60 inches and that is what people have been asking since our tape rule stopped at 60 inches how did you get 120 180 200 and so so this is it by the time you get to the last figure on your tape don't include these parts where we don't have numbers written just stop at the 60 this is 60 inches then you will start all over again okay so we have gotten 60 inches from here now if i measure 10 inches that is 70 inches so you can see it is simple we've gotten 70 if i keep measuring to 20 we've got seen 80 inches but you can actually do it 10 10 okay so since i have 80 inches if i continue to measure let's say 10, add 10 more that'll be 90 i take my tape to that part i measure again that is 100 okay so if i continue adding 10 10 i'll get 110 and what i did in that video is that though the fabric wasn't um, the length of the fabric wasn't as long as that i had to join to get the actual length that i needed okay then this is how i measured it just adding 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 okay to get what i actually needed for each of the uh, layers or for each of the steps on the gyms on the gypsy skirt okay so now let's say we have gotten 100 right so you keep measuring again by the time you measure up to 10 that is 110 you keep going by the time you get to 20 120 130 like so 140 and you keep going on and on until you get to 60 again that is 160 okay remember i measured up to 100 and i started again from 10 by that by the time it gets to 60 that is 160 and if you keep if you continue that way you keep getting the figure so in a situation whereby you don't your fabric okay let's say you need up to 200 that is the, you want up to 200 and your fabric measures like 50 or so by the time you've gotten up to 50 you cut it you measure another 50 so you join you keep joining okay by the time you have joined and you've gotten a, enough length you can measure it just the way i showed you okay so that is simply how to do it okay i hope i've answered your question and i hope this video is helpful so thank you so much for watching please give this video a like yes like it so that it can be recommended to others okay and share with your friends as well and if you have not subscribed up to now please hit the subscribe button it is free okay hit the subscribe button to be part of the family and turn on the bell beside you so that whenever i upload a new video you'll be among those that will be notified so thank you so much and remain blessed i'd love to see you in my next video god bless you all